Hey, you, hey, uh, hold on, I gotta turn off the beep or something, uh, uh, shit, not only is this happening on Firefox, but this is happening on Google, but it will as well, well, it's only loading half of my albums on my old page, and not uploading these. This is why you should not change your layouts. Because when you change your layouts, you get this shit. You get problems after problems after problems. Ever since they forced you on this new layout, I've been having nothing but album problems over and over. Well, half the time they won't load up. I can't add photos to them. They're screwing up my shit. I have to wait to upload. And it's like, oh, you fucking insane. Like, fix the goddamn page and stop having all these goddamn issues. One more thing, one more thing. Why don't you just go back to the old layout that actually works? Oh, yeah, I forgot. If the site, if the layout works, we gotta change it to make it not work because that's how we do it. If it doesn't work, then we have shit to do. If it works, then we have nothing to do and we're bored. So we make new layouts that don't work so that it gives us stuff to do so we're not bored. I forgot. So my brother got some really cool cards that he said he thought was okay. He works at Hallmarks, as you guys know, the factory, and he makes these Hallmarks cards, and he said, he saw these, he made these cards, and had to put these in packages. If he knew that he was putting these cards together to send himself one, he would have not did it. <laughs> but, these are funny, so we're going to go one by one on each card, and read it together. Here we go. A little note to brighten your day. And I love this one because of the butterflies. And if you know me, I love butterflies. Next one is, you make me all smiley with the doggy. And you open it, it says inside out. And they accidentally put two of them in there. One of the deattaches. This one says, you make the world a better place. And when you open it. It says, thanks for all you do. And it's got a cute butterfly and some other things. I took a picture of it. But it looks like something you could color. And make it fancy. Er, but anyways. Nothing but happy. Nothing but happy ahead. I don't know what that means. But you open it up and it says, that's my wish for you. I don't get this card. This is a paper hug. You open it up. And it says, with your name on it. Okay. And that is it for the cards. So I hope you enjoyed that. Okay, so this is the end of the video. Later haters. I didn't really make this as a cooking hour video. But someday, if you ever want me to, I can. Basically, it's Chinese honey chicken with rice. And I made a hamburger from a box and then just cut it up. But you can use regular meat, if you, hamburger meat, if you like. Or you can put chicken in it. You can put whatever you want in it. You can put vegetables in it if you want, whatever you like. And then I put in sirloin then I put in rice oh did I already say that then I put in regular pepperoni because Target didn't have my turkey pepperoni at the time that I got it then I got bacon in here as well with some sauces you can use any sauce or seasonings you like the only seasoning I did was dash on the rice I did duck sauce and tortilla uh, duck sauce, teriyaki, and 
a little bit of Mrs. Dash, or not Dash, a little bit of Dorothy Lynch, and then on the whole thing I did Teriyaki, Dash, and um, shit, Dorothy Lynch. And then when I cooked the soy loin, I just did a little bit of, uh, when I did the soy loin, I did a little bit of uh, teriyaki and, and Mrs. Dash, and it was awesome. I put it on both sides when I cooked it. I did the same thing to the hamburger, and then I put all the ingredients together. So I cooked all the meat by themselves and then added it all together with <coughs> the rice, bacon, and pepperoni. And you can add cheese to it. You can add whatever you want. You can make this by a dish like I did right here by itself. Or you could put it in a burrito. Or you could put it in tacos. Ha you know, hamburger bun. You can make it into whatever you want. You can even put it on chips and have nachos out of it. You can do whatever you want after you make this dish. Usually, I did make a similar dish to this where I'll try and put it in the annotation if I remember to. Where I put, where well, I usually put eggs, bacon, pepperoni, rice, stuff like that, in with sirloin. And that's like my favorite dish. Tonight I decided, what if I added honey chicken to the dish? What would that taste like? And it's amazing. It's really good. I've been eating off of it, as you can tell. I made way too much. That's okay. I can have it for the week. The only problem is, it wouldn't all fit in the bowl, so I had to put it on the plate. So I hope I can eat all this. And it's really good. And if you ever try this dish, let me know in the comments down below. Um, the reason why I didn't do a cooking video or I showed you how I cooked it and everything. I just did what the recipe says to do on the back of each package and cooked them all the way and then did cut them and then do and blah blah blah. And I can put in the annotation how I cook the hamburgers if you like because I know I have one. And the soy line, I know I have that as well. Let me know if there's any other videos that you want to see. Because I know I did this dish as a how-to, as a cooking hour video on how the recipe for it. And then I know I did one of just cooking the soy line itself. So, and if you make this dish and you add other stuff to it, like salad stuff, carrots, jalapenos, whatever... If you had, oh yeah, I did add a little bit of uh, Taco Bell sauce. Just two of those little mild packages. And if you want to add noodles to it as well, pasta to it, that would be great too. Just let me know in the comments down below. And whatever you try, maybe next time I'll try it. As long as it's not vegetables, because I'm not a vegetable person. Sorry, don't like cooked vegetables. Anyways, I'm going to get going, and I'll talk to you guys later. I hope you try this dish, and yeah, later haters.